Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, I'm Lisa. So today's practice is going to be a practice revolving around fire elements. So really building up some heat in our core today. We're still kind of in the heart of summer, so I thought this practice would be really motivating, inspiring, and invigorating really to get your day going and connect to your inner strength and confidence. So grab your mat, no props are required. And be sure to stay through the end of the practice because today I'm adding something a little different. I have picked, if you can see over here by my little angel, I picked a, a positive message from Gabby Bernstein's The Universe Has Your Back card deck. So I thought that would be kind of fun to just pick a message for whoever practices with me in this class for the week. So we'll see what the universe has in store for us this week. So grab your mat, maybe grab some water and breathe with me. Let's begin in Sukhasana, easy seated pose. Relax your shoulders down away from your ears. Rest your palms on your knees and close the eyes. Take a deep inhale through your nose, filling up the belly the ribs, the shoulders, the chest, and a gentle exhale out of your mouth as you soften the face and relax your jaw. Again, big breath in, filling up all the way. And easy exhale, coming into this moment and letting go of your day. One more big breath in, keeping the spine nice and tall, and an easy exhale. And then keeping the lips softly closed, we're inhaling and exhaling through the nose. Keep softening the skin on the face, relaxing the jaw feeling your seat on the earth. As you begin to tune in to your core center, maybe see the color yellow connecting to our solar plexus chakra. And then reach your fingertips out to the side, lift and lengthen. And then on an inhalation, sweeping the energy all the way up, arms come all the way up, bring your palms together. And on the exhale, touch your thumbs right to your heartbeat. Again, inhale, sweep everything all the way up. Exhale, hands right to your heartbeat. Inhale, stoking the fire within. Exhale, bring your palms right to your heart center and take a moment to set your own intention. What lights the fire within you? What can you cultivate today on the mat? And take a deep inhale, seal your intention right at your heart center and an easy exhale. Beautiful, and then blink your eyes open. Come to sit at the center of your mat, bend your knees, lift and lengthen through the spine. I'm going to do some core work here. On an inhale, sweep your arms, reach them up towards the sky, the palms face each other, fingertips up towards the sky. Sit nice and tall, inhale. And then exhale, squeeze your belly, arms reach forward as you round and curl navel to spine. Inhale, sit tall, reach up. Exhale, round and curl, reach forward. Inhale, reach. Exhale, round and curl, squeeze your belly. Inhale, sit tall, reach up. Exhale, round and curl, reach forward. Beautiful, inhale, lift and lengthen. Exhale, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Inhale, reach up. 
Exhale, reach forward, squeeze your core, stoking that fire. Inhale, lift and lengthen. Exhale, reach your arms forward. This time, pick up your shins, squeeze the legs together. So the option here is to touch your toes down and rest your palms on the back of your thigh, coming into Navasana Boat Pose. Beautiful, reach your arms forward, keep the spine nice and long, squeeze that lower belly, chin out of the chest, shoulders away from your ears, breathe, 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 and slowly lower down to a low boat. Good, gently bring in your right knee, interlace your fingers over the shin, and switch. Bring in your left knee as you lengthen that right leg. And switch, keep squeezing your core, as we breathe here for bicycle pose, using all that strength in your core center, good. And switch, left knee in, right, right leg lengthens. Switch, right knee in, left leg lengthens. So use your breath as we switch and really focus on using that core center the whole time. Keep the chin out of your chest and we're breathing, 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 breathing. Right knee in, left knee in. Beautiful. And bring both knees in, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Reach your arms forward, little pulse. Up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, straighten the legs, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Beautiful, crisscross your legs. Come all the way up, plant your palms in front of you, coming right into Adho Mukha Svanasana, downward facing dog. So squeeze your belly, lift your hips. I'd like you to keep your knees bent at first and then begin pedaling out the legs, good, shake your neck, your head, yes and no, no effort in the neck. Tailbone up towards the sky, chest melts towards the thighs. Beautiful, inhale, come high up on your toes, round and curl the spine forward to a high plank. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze that core. Beautiful, squeeze your belly, lift your hips, come right back into downward facing dog. Again, inhale, chin to chest as you round the spine forward to a high plank. Squeeze your belly, lift your hips back into Adho Mukha Svanasana. One more like this. Round and curl it forward. Exhale, squeeze your belly, downward facing dog. Awesome. Beautiful, and then open up your feet mat width apart, walk your hands back, coming into a wide Uttanasana, the back of your mat. Catch your elbows, head hangs loose, grounded through the feet and find a little sway here in your spine, letting go, connect to your breath. Breathe, breathe, breathe. And then inhale, bring your palms on your shins, lift and lengthen the spine. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lift and lengthen, long neck. Exhale, bow in. One more like this. Inhale, Ardha Uttanasana. And then exhale, walk your hands forward, coming right back into downward facing dog. Beautiful job. Breathe. Bring your feet to touch. Inhale, lift that right leg up, open up the hip. On the exhale, bring your knee to your nose, squeeze your belly. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, crunch it in, squeeze. Inhale, kick it all the way back. Exhale, squeeze your belly. Last one, inhale three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. And then gently bring the knee down. Pick up your left leg, point your toes, look forward. Exhale, lower down for tricep push-ups. Inhale, lift. 
exhale, lower. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower, sunbird. Inhale, press it up. Exhale, elbows hugging into the midline. Inhale, press it up. Touch your left toes back down. Inhale, three-legged dog with that right leg. This time, bend your knee, open up your hips. Stack your hips, lowering that left heel to the ground and breathe. Inhale, straighten that right leg. Exhale, look forward, step your foot forward. We're in a low lunge. Awesome, on your fingertips or use blocks here. Breathe, breathe, breathe. You can always gently lower that left knee to the earth. Awesome, plant your left palm down, inhale, reach that right arm all the way up for a low lunge twist. Breathing, breathing, breathing. Look down, exhale, plant your right palm on the inside of your right foot. Inhale, sweep that left arm all the way up. Good, so that right shoulder is up against that right knee. Breathing, breathing, breathing. Look down and then exhale. Plant your left palm next to your right palm and we're gonna bring that right foot all the way back. Stack your feet coming into Vashisasana, side plank. Awesome, align your head, heart and hips. And if it feels good, you reach that right arm up, maybe bicep over the ear, play here. You can always stagger the feet. And then inhale, reach the arm back up. Exhale, look down. Come right back into plank pose. On the exhale, lower down for Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, squeeze your belly, lift your hips. Downward facing dog. Awesome job, beautiful, connect to your breath. Sway it out, anything that feels good for you. Shake your head, yes and no, I got this. Burning away all blocks to love, to strength, to resilience. You got this. Other side, feet together. On an inhale, reach that left leg all the way up, open up the hip. Exhale, crunch that knee in, squeeze. Inhale, straighten it back, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose, squeeze your core. Inhale, kick it all the way up. Exhale, crunch it in, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Last one. Inhale, three-legged dog. Beautiful, exhale, knee comes in, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Gently release that left knee down. Pick up your right leg, point the toes for sunbird, look forward. Inhale, exhale, lower. So it's chaturanga arms. Inhale, press it up. Exhale, lower. Elbows hugging in. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. Sunburn, chin and heart come down. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. Inhale, press it up. Touch the right toes down. Inhale, three-legged dog with that left leg. Bend your knee, stack your hips, drop your right heel towards the earth and breathe. Beautiful, connect to your breath. Align your ears with your biceps. Inhale, straighten that left leg up. Exhale, look forward, step that left foot forward, finding our low lunge. Remember to use blocks on your fingertips or gently Release that right knee down. These are always variations. Rock and roll here a little bit. Breathing, breathing, breathing. Good, plant that right palm down. Inhale, sweep that left arm up towards the sky. Open up your heart, your collarbones. Beautiful, a long neck. Keep the neck in line with the whole spine. That cervical spine. Good, exhale. Plant that left palm on the inside of your left foot as you reach your right arm all the way up. The left shoulder is up against the left knee, reaching back through your left heel. Breathe, breathe, breathe. And then exhale, look down, plant your right palm down, stepping that left foot back, 
finding side plank. Good, bring that top arm to your hip first. Find the alignment of your head, heart and hip. And then when you feel nice and solid, reaching that top arm all the way up, find any variation that speaks to you. Stagger the feet, bicep over the ear, squeezing your core the whole time. Take an inhale, exhale, look down. Good, lower down, find your vinyasa, chaturanga dandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, downward facing dog. Beautiful job, awesome work. Find your breath. And breathe. And then inhale, come high up on your toes, bend your knees, look forward. A little hop, crisscross. Bring your seat all the way down, coming right back into Navasana. A little more core work, you know this. Good, breathe, breathe, breathe. Find your variation. You can always touch the toes down, catch the back of the thighs. Good, breathe, squeeze your belly. And slowly lower down for our low boat ride. And then we're gonna find that bicycle. Right knee in, squeeze and lift. And switch, left knee in, right leg straightens. Beautiful, and switch, stay lifted. Focus on using that lower core, increasing that strength, that confidence, and burning away all that holds you back from all that you want to cultivate. Left knee in, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Right knee in, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Left knee in, switch. And switch. Beautiful, last one, switch. Bring both knee in, knees in, reach your arms forward, find the pulse for two. For three, four, five, six, squeeze, breathe, eight, nine, and 10. Straighten your legs, reach up, little pulse. Two, you got this, towards the toes. Three, four, five, you got it, burn. Squeeze, breathe, and squeeze everything tight. Awesome, and release. Shoulders and head come all the way down. Beautiful job. Bring those knees in. Exhale everything out, a gentle rock and roll. Awesome work. And then plant your feet. Let's do Satu Bandha Sarvangasana. Bridge pose here for a little release in our abdominal core. Plant your feet. Relax the arms down at your side. Press into the feet, lift your hips, tuck your tailbone towards the underbelly of your knees. And then exhale, slowly lower one vertebra at a time back to the earth. Again, press down to lift your hips. We're not moving our neck. The chest comes towards your chin Tuck that tailbone, open your heart. Slowly lower one vertebra at a time back down. Last one, press down to lift up. Good, a variation here. If you have space, interlace your fingers underneath you. You can come up onto the tippy toes, find a little bit more space, opening up the heart tucking the tailbone towards that underbelly of the knees. Breathing, 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 not moving the neck. Relax your jaw. One more inhale. And then exhale, drop the heels. Release your hands. And lower down one vertebra at a time. Awesome work. Open up the feet mat with a part, windshield wipers with the knees, neutralize the spine and breathe, feeling that warmth, that fire burning in your core center, that yellow color burning bright. 
and then taking a twist, bring both knees into your chest, open up your angel wings, arms open up, palms facing up, inhale. On an exhale, dropping both knees all the way over to your right and letting go. Scan your body with the breath, relaxing every muscle in the legs, the thighs, the shins. Relax the shoulders. Your heart space is open. And we're coming back to our natural breathing pattern here. Gently firm up your lower belly. Keep your arms where they are and come back to center with the knees. Take an inhale. On your exhale, dropping both knees all the way over to your left, letting go. You can always use a block beneath the knee, between the knees to give your lower back more room. Take a big breath in and a big breath out. Beautiful, slowly begin to firm up your lower belly. Take the knees back up to the center. Lift your shoulders, your head, reach towards the soles of your feet. Squeeze yourself in a tiny ball, tight, tight, tight. One more big breath in and then exhale, lowering the body down into our final resting pose. Shavasana, lengthen your legs out, relax your arms down at the side, palms facing up. Walk your shoulders away from your ears, let your feet fall apart and relax the jaw. Seeing the bright color yellow burning at your core center softening the skin on your face, feeling your whole spine supported. And this is where our practice is integrated, letting the body absorb all the practice in the physical body, our mental body, emotional body and energetic body. Relaxing every muscle Coming back to your inner strength. Letting go of all that blocks you from your dreams, your goals, all that you want to manifest. It's all possible. Connecting to this inner strength that resides within you. Yogis stay here as long as your soul is asking for. Otherwise, take a deep inhale, begin to wiggle your fingers and your toes. Bend one knee at a time, plant your feet on the earth and slowly lower the body, roll the body to the right. Rest your head on your arm like a pillow. Take a deep breath in. And on your exhale, slowly press yourself back up. Just like we started into Sukhasana, easy seat. Lift and lengthen through your spine Feel your sits bones rooted back down on the earth. Rest your palms on your knees. Tilt your chin, close the eyes. Experiencing a few more moments of peace. 
before we close our practice. And then reach your arms out again on the inhale. Sweep them all the way up, palms together. On the exhale, bring them down the center line, right to your heartbeat, bowing to the teacher within you. Remember this strength is always within you. Thank you for trusting me to guide your practice. Om Shanti, Om Shanti, peace. Peace be with you always. Namaste. Hi everyone, thank you so much for practicing with me. If you enjoyed this practice, please be sure to hit subscribe, the like button, leave comments, any feedback, I welcome your feedback. And now let's reveal which card popped up from the universe has your back card deck. So here we go. The message is when I focus on my inner light, I see the world through the lens of love. So awesome message for the week. So this is about recognizing that we are all so much more than our physical body. So tap into your inner space this week connect to that inner landscape, recognize that you are more than this physical body and that everyone else that you connect with is way more than the outer surface. So what an awesome message. So let me know if you like this little addition to our practice this week and I will keep going with that. So thank you for practicing and I will see you right back here next time. Have a beautiful day. Namaste. Mm -hmm.